Testing one, two, three. All right, so we know it works. Well, today, this is another vlog for 1-22-2019, or 2019, whichever way you say it. So, I am recording this video on a laptop's webcam, people. A laptop's webcam, what a surprise. For me, it is a surprise, and I am using this. I'm using this Logitech headset to do the sound because the internal microphone is not adequate whatsoever for these videos. And it's not adequate for any videos. Well, I have this laptop here. It's a Hewlett Packard, an HP, not a Pavilion, people. It is not a Pavilion. It's an HP Compact System. It's a 675... 6735B. Uh, there you go. I will be making a video. I have the footage already. It just needs to be edited. And then it will be up on the tube for all of you people to watch on this machine. Now... How I got this in a very interesting deal is for the video, but I have it now. It's a Windows 10 machine. I installed Windows 10 on it, and it runs surprisingly well on Windows 10. It runs better on 10 than it did on 7, which is surprising for a laptop from late 2008, early 2009. The specs on it are somewhat decent. Man, this phone... We're gonna call some people in the later video with my telephone here. It's the Samsung telephone that's on the Verizon network. If you have seen this in my previous videos, this is it. This is the main event. So, anyway, get back to my rambles. This laptop is decent, and I'm using the built-in webcam to record this video. Now, I usually cover up the webcams on these things with tape. Because I'm paranoid. I'm crazy. So I cover them up. However, to do this video, I had to take it off, and every time I do a video, it's got to come off. But every time I'm done with the video, it's got to slap back on which it's tape so I gotta peel off and I gotta rip some more off the roll and I gotta put it back on the laptop isn't that convenient well I'll just buy my own roll of tape if you do this if I do videos every few days on this thing if even that I won't even hit the thing I won't even finish off the roll anytime soon I can go into the summer if not longer with this one roll so I'll get a roll of tape and I'll be doing these videos now that thing's running on its own but I wanted to talk about something here my YouTube analytics well I've noticed that my views and my likes and my comments have been on a downward spiral as the year begins and if I were to make a video on let's say this electronic entertainment Half-Life Prima's official strategy guide Joe Grant Bell Prima Publishing Rockland California if I did a video on this book with tags with everything the views would dip below 10 However, if I were to make a video which was about drama and fighting and all of that bullshit, the views would be up, straight skyrocketing through the previous numbers. I've observed this. 
many times on this account, and many times on YouTube in general. The second that there is a fight, or any sort of controversy, imagine this. This is your analytic. The views go down, 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 down. That happens. It doesn't even arc up. It just shoots up. <laughs> So that's your analytics on YouTube, and that's my thoughts on that situation. It, people care for the bullshit, and people are gonna leave comments asking for more of the stuff with the drama, and it's like a drawn-out adventure with these people. But anyway, off of that topic. You might notice I'm talking a bit strange here. I'm been talking all day, I've been doing different things all day. So I'm trying to be kind of quiet also because there are people sleeping right next to me. And there's people sleeping over there, so. Stay somewhat quiet, but I get loud too. <laughs> so, you know, if you notice I am... Oh, nice. I've been having a few problems with this cell phone lately, this Samsung Saga phone. I might do a video on this thing because it has been not quite the saga. The revival of the saga has been certainly a saga. So, you know, I've been looking at getting back. I played Civilization IV, 1000 AD scenario on that live stream. Um, the Jed Redux stream it was. And well, I happened to gain an interest in the Civilization franchise again. And I have versions 2 through 4 on the disc. I have the 4 complete with no DRM on it, and I have the 3 complete with the DRM, the old box and then I have Civilization 2 just the disc and a cheap generic small CD case which is fine for me but I had played Civilization 5 and Civilization 5 I thought was okay but I did not enjoy it as much as 4 or 3 I did not like the soundtrack as much and I just did not find the gameplay as interesting I did however like the concept of the, the city states I thought that was a good idea and I would like to see them I do not know if they have the city states in Civilization 6 or if they have expanded on that idea if they still have them. If so, then I'll find out. I've been trying and trying and trying to download the Civilization 6 demo, but it requires a 64-bit operating system, which I do not have. It needs 64 little bits, and I only got 32. Why? Because about a year ago, I decided, even though I was running on a 64-bit processor, to install a 32-bit operating system. Why did I do that? I don't know. But I did. So now i got to find some kind of way to up it to the 64-bit. Because I want to play Civilization 6. I want to download the demo, and then if, I, if it runs well on the machine and it Seems like it'll be worth it. I'll go for it and I'll buy the buy the game. Now I know it requires the Steam Network and everything, and I really don't care for that. I like having the game locally, but you know what can you do about it nowadays? You really can't do anything about it. So that's pretty much it for my ramble on Civilization. Now what else do I have to ramble? The United States government in this month of January. We are now, it is January 22nd, 2019. On December 22nd, 2018, the United States government shut down due to the fact that they could not, the Congress could not reach an agreement on funding for a border wall with Mexico. Now, the fact that the government has shut down over such a small thing 
is in its own ridiculous. But the fact that they have yet to resolve the situation one month later, they are dealing with so many problems. Half of the government's fighting to open up certain industries of the government. There's problems with people's pay. People are not getting their tax returns this year. I mean, it's a big problem. And it really shows the state of the government. I don't have any specific... I don't have any specific side in current politics in the United States. I really do not care to take a side. I don't like either of them as it stands right now, but I am not a fan of our current government. The fact that it is impossible for us to reach an agreement on anything. There's no compromise anymore. I wouldn't know how to compromise. Anyway, um, you want to talk about that? It's been two whole years, and I'm about to start this big old controversy. Possibly. In which I will get the views. <laughs> which is like one of the things where it's like, it'll come whenever you don't expect it to. And it will be on a live stream. I'm saying it now. You guys watch my f future live streams and you might see what I'm talking about here. There will be something that Nerti Lequendo has brought up before. That's my hint. So anyway, just stupid stuff. My drama, if I want to lure in more viewers, I will say that I'm going to reveal some big secret. Am I going to reveal a big secret? I won't say. I will not say. Anyway. The drama continues, though. And would it be a damn shame that it does? Well. I have quite a few different videos that have to be posted in the coming days and the coming weeks and this is one of them so I will be doing a live stream a live event show tomorrow which will be the 23rd of January the 23rd of January 2019 how time flies when you're having fun well, people are going to tell me to stop speaking all poetic and all the stop the horse shit. You want to go back to that stuff? Well, guess what? I don't have to. If I want to be like this, I can be like this. But at some point it has to stop. People, if you remember this video that I am talking about is a video I made about two years ago, a little over two years ago, then there you go, people. I mean, sometimes I just like to screw around on here, but whatever. I'm not normal. Everybody knows that I'm not normal. I'm abnormal. We all are abnormal. I think everybody that does this, every all of us vloggers, we are all abnormal. There's nothing normal about us. To do this, we have to be abnormal. There's no way that we cannot be abnormal. So, i got a nice itch right along the top of my eye. So, we're all abnormal. And if you want to describe it in a different way, how about we're all crooked, we're all bent. As in Out of the Silent Planet by C.S. Lewis, the people did not have a word for horrible or terrible or like bad people. They had no word for those people. The only thing that they could come up with was bent. Bent. And C.S. Lewis was one of those wholesome Christian authors, even though he wrote some pretty hot shit. And he was an academic. He got away with it. He was a Christian author who wrote some pretty hot shit, we must remember. But he was an academic. Same with J.R.R. Tolkien, writer of The Lord of the Rings. They were friends, in fact. But all of them, all these people, even if they're academics, bent. 
They're probably more bent than I am in my strange form. To do such things, to be a vlogger, to write these stories, you have to be bent to a degree. I think we all are. I don't think there's anything called normal. There is no such thing as normal. We're all abnormal. The human species is abnormal. Maybe I will do a video on Out of the Silent Planet because it's quite the story. I would like to talk about that on video. But that will be for a future rant on this because I want to keep this below 20 minutes so I'm nearing that point though. I'm at 16 almost. Well... It's January. It's the long, long January. This one has not been very long, I must say, compared to the one of a year ago and the one of two years ago, even the one of three and four and five. Not very long. It has gone by quite quickly. However, I can obviously see that something has got to change here. In this January, I have definitely realized that there needs to be some kind of reset. This shit's gone pretty freaking wild. So, what can I say? Maybe I will go into this subject further on the next vlog or in the live stream, but I must say that the shit's hit the freaking fan. So, I'm pretty abnormal. And that's why the shit's hit the freaking fan, is because I am abnormal. I am bent. If I was normal, I would not be in the situation where shit hits the fan. The proverbial spinning fan. Well, I was out of town last week. It was nice to get out of town, if even for a short time, because as you guys know, I do not leave this place as much as I should. Now, the weather here sucks. It's 20-something degrees, if not lower than that right now. There's really not a whole lot to do during these winter months. I would love to make it down south. In the southwest of the United States of America is where I want to end up. The weather there... At this time of year, I could still go out and do a lot of stuff. But we would be having a monsoon now, wouldn't we? Well, if you like it when it rains, you want to be there in monsoon season. Now, I really don't care for the rain, but it's better than the snow. I'd rather have a monsoon sneezing than a snowstorm. So... Maybe someday I'll be down there. I'll end up in the Mojave. I'll be hidden in the Mojave. Someday. I'll be just out of town, hidden in the Mojave. <laughs> and that has to do with our other topics here. So, this has been a random ramble. Where I've been talking all crazy. And I've had a lot of different topics from this HP laptop to Out of the Silent Planet by C.S. Lewis to how humans are not normal creatures and no, hell no, we are not. If you compare human beings to other species, you'll see that humans are more unique than any other species on an individual basis because of our cognitive intelligence. The fact that human beings are such independent thinkers versus even animals like dogs that have pack mentality. They have pack mentality. That's the thing. They have pack mentality. So human beings are abnormal because they are unique. A d random dog is very similar to another random dog, especially one that's of the same breed very similar. Of course, they can all have their different mannerisms and everything, but the 
their thought train is pretty much identical in a lot of ways. But human beings are very unique on an individual basis. And that's why we're bent. We're warped. We're abnormal. We are interesting, twisted creatures, that is for sure. We are not pure. We are not very good either. But we sure, we, we certainly are unique. And that's all I gotta say. This was a, a random ramble. I hope you all enjoyed this. And I hope that the video quality turns out okay. It's only a 480 webcam, but I'm trying, people. It's either this or an Xbox Live Vision camera of the same quality. So, comment your thoughts. Comment your thoughts, people.